So I know this new dungeon that popped up is on the border of the Diamond Kingdom, who we're enemies with or host. We're not friends with. I know that. And this episode's called the Diamond Mage. I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm a little excited. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Black Clover, episode 15. Last episode, like I said, we had a dungeon that appeared. And so to gather all the magical artifacts and va very valuable items, the Wizard King sent, you know, spoiler alert, not spoilers, and Asta with along with Mimosa, Klaus. I'm sure the Wizard King just requested Asta and you know, and then the leaders of their respective teams, William and Yami, decided to send Luck, Klaus, Mimosa, and Noel. Just, you know, because that's what team captains do. But there we discovered a whole bunch of magical traps. You know, saved us from one, but then Luck bolts it off and is going to fight some sort of magic user. No idea what's going on with that. I just really want to see Luck fight and I really want to see some more fights. So without any further ado, if you guys want to support me and get early access to the next bunch of episodes and full length of these ones or the any, any of the other shows I'm watching, consider checking out that Patreon down below. The option is always available for you down below. If you guys want to support me and Patreon is not really your thing, if you could just leave a like and a nice comment down below, it really helps push me out there into the algorithm, get me recommended to a lot of other people. It just, it means a lot. Thank you so much. Let's hop into this Black Clover episode 15. Of course they would trust him, but like Alec Dora Sandler. Fair enough. They can't get over the fact that he's not nobility, you know? That peasant boy, why would you send him? Still don't trust him. <laughs> You probably know some of the other royal families. I'm a fool. <laughs> That's like the third time Klaus has done that, I swear. <laughs> yeah, I thought she would she would know Mimosa. Hey Mimosa, it's been a I was about to say, they probably know each other. I, don't, I, I wouldn't assume the banquet, but like some dinner party get together type shit, you know? Oh, wow. They're related like that, cousin. Bro. They are straight. This is like Eno and Sakura. I know everyone's going to hate that I compare anybody in the show to Sakura, but come on. They're just getting on each other's nerves. This is, they're literally taking jabs. They're literally taking jabs, man. Not ran away, but ran to fight even better. Who? Is he gonna run into? Who? Good. Show me some more, because he had like steel creation. Right? She had the flower type uh, magic. Plant creation. Magic flower guide post. That's what they used to find Yuno, know, right? The first time. So what are we gonna use it in here for? I love how it shows the layout. That is so fucking sick. That is, that is cheat. That is OP. And he's able to make like a wind fucking sail. So easily. Jesus. Jesus, Klaus, relax. But that, like, if they're gonna say, we'll show you the difference in skill, and then they just float away like that, I'll be like, alright. You guys got that. You guys got that. <laughs> We're gonna have our own individual little races. Let's do it. Even though you guys have the advantage, our leader kind of left us and ditched us. <laughs> Where the fuck is luck? Oh! We can always use Nero to help us out. He f Cause I was gonna say, if he hops off Asta's head, you know he has something important to do. <laughs> mm-hmm, we'll see about that. 
けるクラウス先輩あいつのことあまり侮らない He said that in such a non-rude way Just like Come on, I'm just letting you know Awesome, awesome The Diamond Mage, the title, the episode Lotus of the Abyss. Uh, uh, you know, if Julius is saying that. Wow. Demo Kimiwa, son of Cotton Ione. Yeah, lightning magic seems so cool. Some of the magic already seems so fucking dope. I swear I recognize this voice actor though. The guy, the, the old man, Lotus Man. Oh. Did he turn into smoke? It definitely can. The fight for natural resources. I want to see him like actually go ham. Something tells me he's definitely still just fucking around. Oh, wow, he knows the Black Bull specifically, too. Oh, my lord. He's fought with Julius and Yami. Oh. See, he always is just saying these things. That's so scary. Look at young Yami. See, he says this shit like I'm scared, I want to cry, I want to run. The smoke. He's been breathing in something that's... Oh, my God. See, I've been telling you, this guy's been... He just plays a lot. He's like, I'm so scared. Oh, my God. Debilitating his senses and shit. The smoke's in his lungs. I need to... Ooh, Lotus of the Abyss. Yep. It's called Weakening Smoke Magic Garden of Plundering Smoke, if you were wondering. I see. Very smart. In a 1v1 magic fight... This would be very smart. He's he started it from the very beginning. Wow. It takes a little bit to kick in. That's why he was playing on the defensive, going away, stalling for time. Who is that? Wow. If anything looks like a treasure room, it would be fucking that. Yeah. You guys are very talented. I'll give you that. You guys have some very cool magic. Something's gonna attack her from behind. She has a magic shielding cloak and it went right through it. And she didn't even. And she's an expert at sensing mana? Ooh. He has an interesting design. And I'm guessing he's also from the Diamond Kingdom, hence the diamonds. And he's talking about friends and shit, yeah. Come on, Luck. Ooh, oh my god, the way that looks. It's like an eagle's talons, but made out of lightning. That's, that sounds like something Hisoka would say. I'd rather not pluck a bud while it's so young. I like that. That was a good episode. Well, for setting up more of uh, some potential enemies out there in the world, this episode did a really good job. Like, I, for one, am a huge fan of seeing new power systems in animes. Like, 
Nen and Hunter Hunter blew me away and opened my eyes to so much possibilities when it came to power v powers and stuff like that. Like before that, I was always just like, as long as I'm stronger than you, as long as I can scream louder, I should win. But certain shows put me on to like technically no matter like oh it's it's so, and i love it too like certain strategies will obviously outbeat your opponent no matter what there are certain people who are op against other people but like will literally get shit on by other people like it's so realistic it's so well done like like and like i, I don't have many examples of magic users in this show to pull from but like once I get a little bit of a of a knowledge base of magic in my head, I could literally throw some wild ass fights together, like some what if fights, and it would be like a debate. Like I could debate with people on who would win, because then I'd be like, oh, we'll have the Lotus of the Abyss versus Luck. Oh yeah, well Luck is ten times faster. He's gonna be he has you know this that and the other. I'm like yeah, but my guy can do this. He can do that. And then by the time he's done that, he's already doing this and that and the other. Like it's like it's way more than just dragon ball z fighting should i say and there's nothing wrong with dragon ball z fighting i love me some some fucking kick-ass fights but i also love strategy and and thought and reason behind the moves you make i love that oh so very much but luck is going through it the lotus of the abyss the diamond kingdom is proving very formidable um lacking some resources so that's why they're trying to expand their borders makes a whole lot of sense I am just so ex uh, I did meet another one of the Golden Dawn today, Alec Dora Sandler, who also doesn't like you know, which makes sense. But like, come on, guys, he's you know, if your leader likes him, come on, like him. But I think I'm gonna hop into this next episode because this one was super fun. Remember, guys, if you don't want to wait for the next bunch that I upload, you can always check out that Patreon down below. Look at early access. If you guys want to see the full length, those are available to you as well. If you guys did like this, please leave a like and let me know what you thought down below. It helps me oh so much. Appreciate y'all. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out.